members of our military. Carity on News Channel 13's Michaela White was there for the festivities. At the Southeast Armed Services YMCA, <laughs> the spirit of Christmas is everywhere you look. And for Nanny Allison Paul, I signed up for this for me and my kids. It couldn't have come sooner. It's important to, you know, make them feel like they're included in things, when, especially because their parents are gone a lot and maybe they don't get to go out and do a lot of things. We have deployments that are going on. We have many families are separated from their loved ones. This is Reagan. She's nine months, and that's Joshua. He's three. Reagan and Joshua are two of hundreds who are getting holiday meals for free. In total, 500 of these meals will be distributed here in Colorado Springs. That's part of 8,500 nationally. The bags were very generously provided by Walmart, and they consist of the elements for a holiday meal as well as a holiday breakfast. So we have pancake mix, syrup, dressing mix, can canned green beans, corn, things of that nature. Operation Homefront says it's the least they can do to help our heroes. The holidays can be a very expensive time for service members. There's a lot of stress and so anything that we can do to help families, especially those who are serving and sacrificing for our country, it's so important to make sure that we're helping them and their families with everything that they need. Can you tell them thank you? You're so welcome. And for these three, their generosity means a memorable holiday season. In Colorado Springs, Michaela White. KRDO News Channel 13. Ah, what a generous gift. In total, 26 locations nationwide distributed holiday meals, and Operation Homefront says it's their sixth year here in Colorado Springs. Now they plan to hand out even more meals next year. Well, the Dow dropped triple digits for the second day in a row, closing down 367 points to erase the gains from earlier in the week. NASDAQ down seven.